Breast cancer is generally diagnosed initially by a mammogram. On a mammogram, what we generally look for are calcium deposits. Your breasts always make calcium as part of the milk that they make. The calcium deposits, however, in cancer look irregular and scattered in patterns that are not normal. Calcification in the breast is normal. What we're looking for are abnormal calcifications. We also use things like ultrasound, where we use sound waves to determine the size of any abnormality in your breast. We use MRI, which looks at the characteristics of the water in your breast and flow of blood in various areas. If an area on MRI has persistent blood flow, that's more likely to be abnormality than a benign uh, disease. Finally, once we find these abnormalities by any of these modalities, we then do a biopsy. Uh, the biopsy usually is through a needle thick enough to obtain tissue uh, for analysis to determine whether the cancer, whether the tissue is malignant or benign.